I am announcing that I am running for the office of Milwaukee County Executive. And with that, State Senator Chris Larson set the stage for a top tier political showdown. Larson is challenging incumbent Milwaukee County Executive Chris Abley. Abley has been behind a number of high profile initiatives aimed at things like reducing homelessness and is credited with helping to secure a new Bucks Arena deal. But he's also at the center of a controversial plan giving him control over some struggling MPS schools. And it's that and other issues that Larson believes show Abley is out of touch. I have grown disappointed to learn that Chris Abley is not who we thought he, he was when we voted for him. Larson is a former county supervisor and current state senator who was one of the Democrats who fled the state during the Act 10 debate. He rose to become the Senate Democratic leader before stepping down from that role earlier this year and now says he'll build a grassroots campaign to take on Abley and is already getting a powerful boost from Congresswoman Gwen Moore, a former Abley supporter. It's really sad to have to withdraw your support from someone uh, that uh, you so enthusiastically supported. It's time for new leadership. A Larson Abley matchup is also likely to force many of Milwaukee County's top Democrats to choose sides. It's not a Republican thing, it's not a Democratic thing, it's not an independent thing. Uh, to make sure you have somebody who is from here, who is not out of touch. Now, Chris Abley was not available to us on camera, but in a statement he said today, I look forward to the added opportunity to talk with voters about how we're turning the corner in Milwaukee County and getting our fiscal house in order after years of uncertainty and mismanagement prior to my taking office. The election is next April, but Joyce, the campaigns will wrap up quickly, and this is going to be a hotly contested race.